Hello brothers, sisters, boys and girls, and my beloved Elena. Welcome back to Castlevania Lords of Shadows number two. As I promised, said last year that I would end up completing this. I'm just sorry I'm late on that. I'm gonna do this now. I'm gonna try my best to complete it before Halloween or at least on Halloween, so that means a lot of grinding, so join me for this adventure. Thank you for uh, subscribing, and thank you for support, and thank you for the 60 uh, people I got following me. Thank you so much for everybody. Alright, let's move on. Giving that look. That sexy look. Alright. Whereas we're seeing right here, you're playing as old, old Dracula. Or, uh, Gabriel. Gabriel Belmont. Gabriel has definitely seen some better days. Man, I tell you. And I can free you of your immortality. Oh, really? That scream sounds like it's from the one movie called uh, The Thing, which was crazy. The movie, good lord. And that right there would be a young, young Trevor Belmont. Or I should say the spirit of him. Like, watch. I think when you do this... Or, I don't know, when he uses you walk away, he says wait, you know, to tell you, like, to follow him, you know? Wait. Get up, you, sir. Sorry, miss, I don't have no change on me. Let's head back at the castle. Here, join some gear. Uh, what type of fucking gear are you talking about? I try my best not to talk during the scenes. Gabriel, I don't, I don't think we can... I think we're supposed to lose this fight if... Or, of course we're supposed to lose this fight. Because we're fighting a demon, we're not even at our full capacity. That's a cool looking ring. Damn. I think we're in control. Yep, we're in control. So it's like a horror movie. Oh boy. Man, 
we could have just get, uh, used the husband. But I guess we need more than that. Sorry. Oh, she's a husk. Oh, forgive me, little girl. I can never get over that part. Son of a bitch. There's the Dark Knight. Not bad, man. <laughs> Sean Connery. Oh, my bad. Me to see you recover, old friend. Definitely does look like a Sean Connery. Our guest is just a little confused. I know what he wants. You see before you, the legendary vampire killer. Your old weapon, if you recall. The only weapon capable of ending your immortal life. You thought it destroyed. But you see, you can have the eternal rest you crave after all. First, you must help me. Prevent Satan's return to the world. Then, I swear to you, I will deliver the fatal blow to your heart myself. And I am sure you will fulfill that vow. Since you sent Satan back to hell a thousand years ago, his human offspring, or acolytes as they call themselves, have been dormant. I suppose that they, that all of us, feared your wrath and great power. But not now. Now, even my bodyguard is more than a match for you. The acolytes know you are weak and are preparing for their father's return. Now they fear nothing. Don't they fear the mighty Zolbeck? Zolbeck. The mighty Zolbeck. In full possession of your powers can defeat them. Oh boy. Please. That's mom texting me. They're bringing home pizza. The we great Gabriel. We destroy the acolytes before they can finalize their preparations for Satan's return. It won't be easy. They govern the world of men from the shadows. Not even I know with any degree of certainty who or where they are. That would be the room where we kill those people. They won't come out into the light unless we can force their hand. Son of a bitch. Don't see the kid though. Never know who <coughs> them down. The element of surprise will give us the advantage. Until you are at full strength again. And you don't know who they are. Do 
you know using a thing like snake plissken is built upon the foundations of your castle the acolytes are focusing their attentions here for very good reason satan has specifically chosen this place for his return he means to enslave you first to humiliate you for what you did to him let's get on with it come on sean connery let's hear this plan mr good speed Lights must plunge the world into chaos before Satan can be summoned. Their activities leave spectral traces, which are difficult but not impossible to follow. This is the headquarters of a powerful pharmaceutical corporation. I suspect that one of the acolytes is operating from there. The complex was sealed two months ago and is protected by magic. If I were to use my powers to see what is happening there, it would be able to trace it back to me within a matter of minutes. Hmm. So, I will send you to the corporation via a portal. But we must be quick so as not to arouse suspicion. The longer the portal remains open, the more likely we will be discovered. Look for any sign of the acolyte. But be careful. What are you waiting for? Oh man, it never changes. We're always being the errand boy. That's pretty fucking cool. Never gets old. Never ever gets cold. I meant old. Holly. One thing I don't understand, they never really... Looking good in the neighborhood. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> anyway, as I was trying to say, is um, they said this game wasn't very well received. I fucking loved it when it came out. I loved the first one tremendously. Loved the middle one, which would be a Mirrors of Fate, which will be on this channel soon. And then I love this one. To me, it's like a modern day take on Dracula. I like it. Not a lot of people like it. I don't understand why. Yeah, I must investigate. Um, what are the fuck they call it? The pharmaceutical place. So yeah, the current mission is marked on the map, which is behind my head. Yeah, I don't know whether to move my uh, head or not, so we're just going to just roll with it and see what we can do. Let's see. Trying to get used to the controls again. And also, I think we're going to have to be collecting points again to be able to... Uh, to be able to level up our fighting abilities. Let's see, Chronicles of the Ancient Light, City Memorials, 
mementos, I guess. On the on the exact spot of this memorial, what are known as the and the chronicles of the ancient light were discovered 500 years ago. Those encrypted texts detail the horrifying experiences of those who managed to escape from the claws of Dracula. Most of them lost their mind and parts of their bodies too, devoured by ghouls, vampires, harpies, some sexy harpies. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, those survivors soon died of the most awful, I was going to say horrific, but I guess they're talking about something awful, all uh, different, awful infections and, I don't know how to pronounce that word, I guess it'd be like, uh, diseases or something. However, a few managed to return safe and sound thanks to the map. Maps of the inside. Maps of the inside of what? What are you talking about? Of the castle and previous tales of the horrors that took place inside were pieced together. It was the great... Oh, I know his name. Palatine of God who was... Who made military use of these maps. Gaining knowledge of the castle that... In, Hindsight was cruel to defeating, crucial to defeating the Prince of Darkness. Reland, I don't know, you know how to pronounce that name, but would that be the guy that created the cross that Gabriel used in the first game? Because he's always well known. Like the only time I've ever seen him in a Castlevania game was the one for number two, Castlevania. Uh, I don't think it was called Curse of Darkness. It was, I think that was probably the second one that had Hector, and he wasn't even a Belmont. He was just a Forge Master. But the other one was, uh, I don't know if it was Victor Belmont or Trevor Belmont. I don't think he was even Simon Belmont. It was one of those Belmonts, but you meet an old man in the woods that had a cabin located at the base of what castle is, the castle of Dracula was. And his name was this R O L A N D guy. Paladin of God. Huh. We'll read more of that stuff later on. Alright, let's get moving here. Curious. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was just curious, could I bust the actual fire hydrant? It looked like it was breakable. The red glow over an item. Shadow daggers, okay. Interesting. I played this game so many times, but yet I cannot remember everything. Man, how many times have I played it? That's the question. God. Oh, and there's the rots. We're going to be using those rats to our advantage. Since the presence of a Golgoth god, you are no match oh, for this what? enemy. Then. Say that five times fast. I can hide that. Stop drinking something, I'm hallucinating. What the fuck? Okay, you're gonna move? We 
Because I think he's going to shoot me if I get too close to his ass. Use the unguarded dark area to recover your appearance. And then from there you can backstab his ass if he doesn't fucking move. At least I think I can backstab his ass. The guard hasn't seen you. Get close to him and use your power of possession. If you remember how to use it. I just press O, right? Yeah, press O. All right, come on, big boy. Need to get this door open. He's doing the limbo. Uh, uh, don't, don't. I don't have much time. Come on, come on. Limp over there so we can fucking use this. Hopefully I don't get demonetized for so much blood. Uh, let's see, guard. Let's see, raids in laboratories. The golem can be considered the link between, a link that connects man and machine and the evolution chain. Their clone bodies have been generated, alters to grow much more quicker, quickly and larger than a normal human being. Their mind, on the other hand, have not had time to develop. If it were not for implanting uh, restricted incisions or suppressing emotions, they would be able to. They would be no different to a child. Their sole aim is to defeat, defend, basically the place. From intruders, and for that purpose, they are equipped with un basically armor and a uh, grenade launcher. <coughs> okay, a little bit um, overkill, don't you think? I saw you hiding there. You're going to die, dog. Yeah. Can you imagine having them? Um, survey a facility they end up seeing something they end up just fucking launching grenades every fucking where you would end up losing more money than uh, gaining money oh I'm gonna the fuck was that about like Gabriel did like a little loop and then walked. Alright, there is a... Uh, the ladder I need to get to, but I need to get past them. Interesting. I think I saw something in that uh, the air vent too. You can distract certain guards by firing a bat swarm at them. Okay, but before we do that, see, I see something in there. Looks like an element. But how the fuck do you get in there? Um, whoa. I'm curious, so let's see. Okay, don't know how to get up there. Should be like an air vent somewhere. Or 
some type of vent. Aha, right here. Follow me, brothers and sisters. Whoa, okay. Okay, um... Fuck me. Wait, what the hell? There's something in there. I don't know how to get... I think I'm gonna die if I go through this. Oh dear. Yeah, I'm gonna die if I go through that. So, um, yeah. Ooh. And that's what happens. Nope, you can jump. Just uh, ended up dying. Let's see, uh, can I jump over here? Huh. Come on, good lord. Okay. I'm gonna end up dying before I get the fuck out of here. Oh boy. Oh, there we go, for fuck's sakes. Okay. If I was to distract them, what would I do? Because you have one... You have one patrolling. Hold R2. Ow. I'm gonna end up dying. Yep, I'm uh, rusty. Very, very rusty. I must investigate Biochemec Corporation. Biochemec, is that what it's called? I've been calling it the pharmaceutical place for the whole fucking time. Oh well. Alright, yes, we already know the ladder's there. Skipping the cutscene. You know the one thing that I really miss from this game is um The castle bats have shared their space with the Prince of Darkness for countless years. The powerful influence of their lord has bound them to his very being as if they were a part of his own body in bygone times Dracula never needed the disreputable abilities of these creatures but his new situations forces him to use them to things even things up yeah okay and I guess that's all the abilities really so Fuck, I didn't mean to do that. Fuck me. I saw you guys right there, you're gonna die like a dog, yada yada yada. Ah. Uh. 
Fuck me. Oh, one mouse left, really? Wait for the shadow portal to... And the rats come back. But yet, not my fucking health. Yes, I'm holding R. Oh. Come on, come on. Mother of God. Oh, these are the bastards you're going to fucking hate for a bit. Something is going on at Biochemic Corporation. Oh, we know. We know a great deal. We've been through this shit time and time again. Don't give me that look, Gabriel. I'll smack that fucking face off you. Or Dracula, whatever the fuck I should call you. Enough, alright. Fuck six. Don't get me wrong, I do like the game. Just, they should have adapted a lot of different things. I hope my audio holds up because I've been hearing kind of some like graphical glitches with it. capability of reaching that place yet but whoa 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 what is that why would I want to go down Well, I mean, I guess there's a way of proceeding, but what about up here? This place is going to be fucking huge. Fucking huge. Oh boy, here we go. Who are you? Follow me if you wish to recover your sword. Oh, the Vulpal Sword. I keep saying Vulpal Sword. It's not a Vulpal Sword. It's the fucking Void Sword. Oi! Got fucking Alice in Wonderland on the brain here. For fuck's sake. I'm gonna be transported back to the castle. As you can see, everything's changed on the sides. Oh god, I love Castlevania. I could never beat it as a kid. Because it was so fucking hard, but... Since I'm a little bit better at games now... <laughs> not judging by earlier, okay? Don't laugh at me, but I'm uh, I'm tempted to give a shot with the Nintendo ones because I really would like to go back to the Nintendo, Nintendo and Super Nintendo. Oh, I miss reading these guys, uh, these guys' bios or uh, their uh, thing about them dying or something like that. All right, memory of Sir William Wren. We've been so ner uh, nerd. Naved? We've been so naved we thought we could 
enter Dracula's castle, defeat his army, and avoid all of his traps without suffering any damage or casualties, I should say. Damn the captain and his stupid fairy tales. Now I see the pack of lies they use to swore our pride. Burn the, th the pen and decide and describe what you see so that our comrades learn of your heroic feat, he told us. My story ends in this cold corner, brother, without the cheers of the people or the sound of the shining triumph trumpets. Before finishing my writing, I must tell you that not everything in this place brings death until now I have survived thanks to some strange artifacts that hide bleh, that hide valuable secrets that hid valuable secrets. I trust that you will find them and that their content will help you in your fight. Alas, it's already too late for me. Tell my darling wife Beatrice that I love her. And tell my strapping a lad Tim to take him straighten up and be a good lad. Sorry. <laughs> Poor guy, I would say. No, that's fucking cool. I am. I guess I'm supposed to go that way. But over here. This is a blood child. Use it to recover your life. Interesting. That doesn't give me, uh, I gotta boost my health, so that's gonna come in effect later on. So, okay. You do not have the necessary power to break that. And there's a box over there. So apparently I have to go this way. Far be it from me. Oh, hello. This gives me health. Get five of those and it increases my health. What? Um... Am I even going the right way? That is one trouble I had uh, playing this game, trying to figure out where the fuck I was supposed to go. Is this the right way though? That's my question. God, I love the sheer beauty of this game. Even the first one was absolutely fucking badass, too. Fuck. Am I truly here? Or is all this a figment of my imagination? Am I dreaming? Even though I'm not sitting in a coffin. Sorry. <laughs> These are the inning wor inner workings of a madman. That blood is clogging the mechanism. Man, I love this game. I really hope I'm going the right way. <sighs> oh, I'm going the right way. No matter how many times I play this game, I always got lost. That would be a young Trevor. I already said this before. 
Definitely got that look of pissed off. Pain box, another health gem, wonderful. There's one down below, I would like to jump down and get it, but... Hmm. There has to be a way to get back up here, I mean... Huh. Fuck it. Let's just go ahead and jump down. Whoopsies. Didn't mean to do that. Definitely gonna need these. Like, freaking for real. Collect five, yada yada yada, we already know. Yep, I was about to say, there should be a way to get back up. Alright, round two. What you did to me and my mother, Trevor. Trevor still holds that grudge. All right, more to read. Hopefully, y'all don't mind a little bit of story time. Cause I love it. The affection of the innocent boy, which the memory of me, emitter of fate. Shared the Dracula returns to the mind of his father as penance for having condemned him to suffering the eternal curse of the vampire. The moment that he never shared with his firstborn came to life now as broken fragments of his memory. Pitting light against shadow and his dark memories. Pitting the broken pieces together seems to be the way to a, a con acquire an unknown purpose. Well, it's not a acquire. The uh, whatever you get the point. That is why young Trevor guides his father through the castle, leading him to the furthest reaches of his mind, where the forgotten memory memories that must be revealed are hidden. You'll pay for what you did to me and my mother, Trevor Belmont. A lot to take in. I know there was one about Dracula. I'll read that another time. Whoa, hold on. Damn. Gotta say, Vic, uh, um, Gabriel, when you wanted them to build a castle, you really, really had a knack for detail. Seems like you also really want to have statues of naked women too. What was with that, buddy? I mean, you got one, you got all, you got a wife. That's all you really need, buddy. Like seriously, that's all you really, really need. So where? Oh, that was cool. See a night. All right, let's read about this guy. 
Mission orders for first class Andrews. Uh, we have been informed of the existence of an something creature made of blood and stone that wanders through. I don't even know how to pronounce that word. Uh, Bonehard's wing. Its origin is unknown, but it may be a powerful ally of the dark or of the Prince of Shadows himself. Your task is limited to observing it and recording reporting to the Council of Wise Men on your investigations. Under no circumstances must you come into contact with it or alert it in any way of your presence. Furthermore, you must continue the work of one of your comrades who ignored our orders conditioning of the area in search of the hidden relics he said he's seen. Remember that no matter what happens, your presence must go entirely undetected. Well, it uh, didn't go undetect undetected. He's um, he's dead. Time to run! Ah! Oh boy! Ah! Ah! Holy fuck, Nuggets. Son of a bitch. I forgot about that. Woo. You have recovered the void power, use the void sword, and steal life. Oh boy, forgot. This is the part I usually hate. Damn. Blood is vulnerable, a stone that... What? Come 
Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, mother of God. Come on. Yes, yes, we know. End this motherfucker. here and go down here there we go what is it you have earned enough experience points okay so let's see that's the shadow whip let's see where are we oh we got 500 Upgrade. Huh. Uh. I mean, really? Do we need that? Because, I mean, I like to have something that's a little bit better. Uh, use it to in combat. Uh, combat to fulfill uh, to fill the meter. Mastery corner. You can. Uh, yeah, I'm getting tongue tied here. Ah. Can't upgrade that one. Can't upgrade that one. Can't upgrade. Can't upgrade. Can't upgrade that one. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna upgrade that bad boy. And then we're going to upgrade this one too. Because we need to be stronger with the actual whip. Because we're going to be using that motherfucker a lot. Which nothing wrong with that. That will need. That one will probably need. That one will probably need. Mamma mia. We'll worry about that later on. I'm really curious. Why is there... I'll take that stone. Beautiful stone at that. My question is, is who... Oh my god, can I at least talk once without being interrupted by something? Yes, we know. I'm talking about this. Who, who is, who is the lady? Who is she? Because you get a shit ton of statues of her over here. Like, even over here. Who is this lady? Let's see, we're going to go in here for a moment. This is a magic cover, okay.
Better hurry up before it breaks. Okay. What does this do? The tears of a saint recovers Dracula's health completely and temporarily increases his health. Okay, yeah, we'll we'll save that for another time when we need it mostly. Need it most. Yeah. Getting tongue tied. I think I need to go that way, but what's what's in here? I think I've done this once before. Yep, there was a secret in here. Secrets. Nice. That would be for, I believe, the sword. Um, I gotta remember how the fuck do I get in there. I think I get an ability later on where I can actually pass through, uh, fucking, uh, stuff. Um. One up there as well. Yes, I know. Re reopen, re relic thing, blah, blah, blah. What's in here? And there's like tons of fucking things. You don't have the key. Like I said, there's so many fucking places to go. I just came from there. I believe that takes me back. But um, before I do, like, I don't know, I'm just going to be exploring. So bear with me, everybody. don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing here. This might give me some secrets or something. What the hell is this? Oh, it's a turned over candle. Let's see. What's over here? Um. Uh, ooh, hello. Pays off. Another blue one. Where's this taking me? I wonder. Ooh, 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 okay. Finding a bunch of secrets. I'm loving this. Nice, found a red one. That makes four. Yay! Okay, so let's see. Curious as to where that takes me. So we're heading back up that way. It's 
Sorry, I just I love exploring. I've always done that in video games. Because I mean, some games were always linear. You would just, you know, defeat an enemy, go through this way, and just continue. Okay, apparently I'm supposed to go this way. Stop, my lord, my friend, my friend. Your what friend? This boy is under my protection. You're not our lord anymore! Come on. I don't know why I'm pressing O, I really don't think it's even doing anything. Come on. Always the hissing. God damn. Take this. Use it, and I will come. Is this real? Or just a dream? Didn't I say that earlier? <laughs>
There is nothing stronger than the love of a father for his son, and even Dracula is able to show it through his tortured memories. The medallion is nothing more than the physical representation of these memories forged by a deep feeling that bonds him to his first son, firstborn, tempered by the regret of, tempted by the regret of having beneath to him, uh, bestowed to him his fateful destiny, the white wolf is his symbol, his constant his contact between constants between worlds and his guide on his journey from the present to the past wherever it mark is found he can you he can call upon it again like this for example but before I do it looks like I can climb over here. I see something over there. Can you imagine? I don't know, like, sitting here, reading a book, even though I wouldn't really want to read it in this place looking all tattered as it is, but it just, it looks badass. And this would be blue, periwinkle blue. I don't know how I could get up there. I don't think there's a way to get up there. Oh boy. What is, oh, uh, definitely gonna need that. I would love to have a necklace like that just to hang around my neck. That is a beautiful wolf. So amazing! Now the statue I just walked past that giant suit of armor. I would love to take and be able to fight like maybe an enemy like that but you don't really get that uh you really don't get that chance basically I think that's the thing that guy was supposed to be keeping an eye on don't worry about that just follow the white wolf
that would be a time thing. Again, back here and it looks like the doorway is open how the fuck do you get to that actually hold on How the hell do you even get to the other side? That'd be my question. How do you get to there? What have we got here? Red! So we're going to be increasing our health finally. Nice. This seems like a smidge though. Fuck sakes, man. So, where am I supposed to be going? Because I don't even think I can get over these guys. I said I didn't have that ability yet. I guess we're going back, right? Why does the arrow look like we're pointing... I guess that corridor. Come on, Gabriel. Come down, come down. Let go. Come on, dude, get down. That. <laughs> For the love of God, stay on the ladder. There you go. Now get down. Get down. I like that. Son of a bitch. I think there's some input lag. There we go. I need to go through here. It looks like I gotta go through here, but it, again, like I said, I don't have that ability just yet. So where am I heading? That's the question. And I don't think that I have the ability to cross over to that yet. Let's see, what was back here? Just for a quick sec. Okay. Aha! There we go. Okay. Oh, right there. I was like, where the fuck is the rats?
Come on, let's move before it turns off. Uh, it melts, okay? Follow me, comrades. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, fuck me. Ow. Oh my god. This is going to be a pain. Oh god, this is painful. I had a hell of a time with this the original time I played it. Really hate to do this, but I want to know what's over here. Let me guess. That was a waste of fucking time, right? Um, guess I go this way? Huh, guess I can't go that way. Let's go this way. Can't go this way either, so we're heading back. Come on guys, we're heading back. We're heading back. There's no easy there's no easy way to take that. Where are we now? Fuck me. God damn. Get my ass handed to me. Die. Oh my god. Those guys are just a fucking pile of dicks. Satan's acolytes must surely be behind this demon infested corporation. Oh, of course they are. Alright. So are we supposed to use this and then do what exactly? I'm trying to remember, my brain kind of just fried. Uh, Why he's doing that though, what are we supposed to do? Because the rats are here for what reason exactly? Oh, 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 now it makes fucking sense. So, so use them to get through here. Instead of being, being killed off like fucking fast. God damn it, man.
Really? So let me guess, the technician's gonna come out. I'm gonna take control of the technician, dude. Yep, pretty much. I remember this. Him and his uh, onesie. <laughs> All right, so it's over with. So come on, come on, come on, move out of the way, move out of the way. So, let's see, we need to go back here. What happens when I use the bat stuff on him? Would it, like, irk the guy? Apparently not. Ooh, that was a hell of a scream. Is that gonna come down for me to be able to use, or what? Yep. Access granted. Access denied. You want a bagel with my coffee? Hello, giant machine from hell. With blood in it, looks like. That is Satan's daughter. I'm going to retreat. Be careful here. Okay. Pretty sure she knows. I forget, do they transform or are they just gonna... Yep, they transform. They look like rats. A bunch of, a bunch of giant rats! Oh boy. Well, demons and also... Uh,
me that blood. Oh wow, that's a hell of a way to go. Definitely knows how to make them. Come on, girl, come on down. Let me whoop me ass. We should be able to discern much from her regarding these acolytes and their plans. If I had known you were coming, I would have made myself more brilliant. Uh, don't kiss me. Don't kiss me. The director of the whatever laboratory is an aggressive on whatever woman who is capable of hiding herself her true appearance from human eyes. Only the beasts of the night can see her for what she really is a twisted reptilian creature that is as intelligent as she is deadly. A lot of people say that for a lot of fucking shit. Like story wise, movie wise. Like they say elegant but deadly. It's like really we get the fucking point. Like damn. During ten long years uh, to perfection the de demonic virus. She has kidnapped human experimented on them. Humans and experimented on them. Corrupted each of their cells to turn them into soldiers worthy of that guy, you know. In battle, she can conduct electrical electricity and more fiercely fast, even beyond the scope of Dracula's vamp vampiric perceptions. Only extreme cold can stop her and keep her mind intact for Zorbeck, who wants to rip the secrets of her daddy uh, acolytes from her inside. I promise it'll be short and sweet. Okay, lady. She's too good for you. Find a way to slow her down. How? No idea what you've got yourself into. Perhaps you can cool her off somehow. I find you very attractive. Yeah, I don't want to date you. I'm sorry. You can't see me. I know that. I cannot attack. I'm good. I'm good. Mother of God. There we go. Just gotta hit her hard enough. No, no. It'll be short and sweet. No, I'm good. I'm good. I don't want I don't I don't want to be touched by you. I really don't want to be touched by you. Give me a bit more time. Come on. Don't leave me, dear. Ah, uh, nope. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Give me a bit more time. Come on. 
I think I'm good. Let's make this more nope, 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 nope. Come on. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm good. Don't want to date you. Don't want to date you. Don't want to date you. Just want to whoop your ass. Mama. You no idea what you've got yourself into. Over here. Okay. Go ahead and make me warm. Come on, come on, come on. Don't leave me, dear. Finally. <laughs> Catch me if you can. There we go. She's at her limit. Make my blood uh, I don't want to hear you say that. Oh. Is she dead? I'm sorry. No. No. Only unconscious. I'm opening a portal. Well, brothers and sisters, boys and girls, and my beloved Elena, I'm going to leave it right there. We just captured um, Lucifer's daughter. Wow. Okay. Uh, creepy woman that really has the hots for uh, Gabriel. Or she's just saying that. Because she thinks she's got luscious woman charms. I don't know. Anyway, my beloved Elena is a lot better than she is. Mm, I love you, Elena. Other than that, without further ado, I'll see you all in the next video. This is Kim Kendrick signing off. Thank you for joining me. Ta-ta for now.